Today I'm gonna explore a beautiful wild area not so far away from where I live. Humans have built two big structures during the 1800 and I want to talk about them a little bit to give you more context. The Samichele Bridge is a multi-level rail and road truss arch bridge across the Adda River. Not well, the bridge consists of riveted beams held together by over 100,000 nails. The second structure is the Bertini's power plant. The Bertini power plant is Edison's oldest hydroelectric facility and one of the oldest in Italy. It was the most powerful hydroelectric facility in Europe, second worldwide only to the Niagara Falls power station. This is one of those places where when the weather is bad, the place becomes more beautiful and those dark moody colors pop up way more. The Samichele Bridge was one of the largest arch bridges in the world at the time of its completion. You know, I relatively care about this construction, but I just want to do my best to give you as much context as I can to allow you to understand and enjoy more this beautiful natural place and its history. These places always give me a strong sense of peace. I just need to listen. From this beautiful body of green water to the sound of bird chirping that fills the air. Nature here is wild and the Adda River is the greatest expression of it. Due to its rapids, the ancient boulders shaped by water during its relentless and powerful action towards rock formations. By the way, in April 1949, at the height of the Three Horns site, it has been found a molar of Mastodon. This animal was belonging to the species of Anangus arvernensis, straight fangs without curves. The instinct animal lived 10 to 1.0 million years ago, ate foliage, shrubs and fruits, and weighed 5 tons and 3 meters tall. The molar was donated to the Civic Museum of Natural History in Milan. There's one thing really important to me that nature teaches to whom are still able to learn. She teaches to look around again and take in the details, something that is becoming really hard to do these days. Most of the time we scratch the surface of things and we never go deeper. Always in hurry, always too afraid to waste our time, but the only thing we waste is the chance to truly live the moment and reach our wisdom and be more human than machine glued on invisible railroad. That's why I will never lose the chance to be in nature. Alone? With my love Erica or with true friends. Thank you.
area has so many trees and plant species that I can barely imagine how it was dense when there was less to no civilization. Can you imagine how it was compared to what it is now? That's it for today guys. See you in the next adventure. And by the way, I will leave Italy for a 10 days trip in the United States on the Smoky Mountains with Erica. I truly can't wait to fly there and record more memories. Stay tuned and be safe.